You know, you're kind of squirrely, ZTF. Why don't you just come over here? Oh, shit. Uh Did she get an actual screamo? Yep, she did. All right, let's see if ZTF is worth his, worth his salt here. ZTF, what in the actual foxtrot are you doing here? Greetings, Captain LG. Alpha 6 sent me down here with this bird to help you get moved to your new forward operating base. Well, that's mighty kind to the CO. Please tell him I really appreciate it. Well, Captain, I don't think Alpha 6 gives a rat's scrotum about your thanks. He just wants his CC set up ASAP and figures it'll take you too long to move all your shit using that Milmo you got. Well, I suppose you're right about that, but I appreciate it, nevertheless. By the way, ZTF, you know you don't need to be wearing that gas mask. The air is perfectly safe in this area. That may be, Captain, but this is my first time with boots on the ground in the quarantine zone, and I'd rather not take any chances with that Rottwalker virus. Suit yourself, ZTF. Well, all this stuff ain't going to move itself, so we best get to it. Roger that, Captain. Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Die Alpha 21. This is the Apocalypse Ranger series. And this, my friends, is Zulu Tango Foxtrot. Say hello, Zulu Tango Foxtrot. No? You don't want to? Okay. <laughs> All right. So um, what I have uh, done here is I'm going to temporarily borrow this chopper here to move to our new location. And ZTF is going to help us do that. Um, but I'm not going to keep the chopper after that because um, I, I built into the role play as you saw at the beginning here um, that uh, Alpha 6, our commanding officer, is helping us out uh, by loaning this chopper to us and ZTF to help with the move. But then when we're done, uh, we'll have to give it back. And um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with, with ZTF or more specifically the NPC mod. Um, I'm taking a little bit of a risk by even installing this at all because... I've heard that, um, well, the mod authors say to use it on a new save, which obviously I'm not doing. And I also heard from uh, someone in my Discord that um, the core file, you know, for this mod uh, also screwed up some of their other mods. So we'll, we'll kind of see how it goes. Um, I mean, if it like royally, royally screws things up to the point where it breaks the save, then I've got, uh, I kind of have a bit of a fallback plan um, and as a part of that fallback pan, uh, plan, <laughs> talk mouth, uh, we would start a new uh, a season two, but continue Apocalypse Ranger. So we'll just see how things go and um, and and play it by ear. Okay. So anyway, yeah, we got the chopper here. Let's uh, let's run over and, and actually move the chopper just a little bit closer to the house here. Uh, this thing has a hundred slots, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, so it's got a hundred hundred slots. Um, and that's gonna of course help significantly uh with the move, plus the fact that we can fly, so we don't need to, you know, uh follow any roads or anything like that. We can go as the as the crow flies, or in this case as the chopper flies. So let's just get it a little closer here. That's good enough. Okay, so let's see. Um, I guess the first order of business here is we, we're, we're going to pick up all of our workstations except for the forges. The forges are cheap and easy to make. Um, you know, so we'll just make new forges at the new place, but we will take all of the tools, the anvils, the crucibles, and that sort of thing. 
Um, so let's start by picking up all of our workstations and loading those in the chopper first. And of course, this is a very heavy workbench, so uh, ZTF is going to have to help me carry it over there and load it into the back of the chopper. We'll grab the cement mixer. All right, you are currently working on gas, but we're going to cancel uh, that and pick you up. Okay. Let's turn you off and just grab the tools out of here. I'm going to throw that stuff in there for the moment. Same thing, grab these tools out of here. And like I said, we'll leave the forges there. Okay, let's run over here and put all these in the chopper. The hella chopper. Guess we can put that fuel in there too. Um, all right. Now I want to pick up three of these dew collectors. We will leave one here for the outpost. And uh, probably this one here because it's the one that's in the water tank. Those guys probably can't climb ladders. Um, they're supposed to uh, just teleport to you, you know, if you get too far away from them. <laughs> How's it going, ZTF? Okay. So we'll put these in here. Oh, those stack too. That's nice. All right. I, I'm, I'm doing all the workstations first before we start doing the actual, you know, items themselves. Uh, so in here, well, you know, actually, I don't think there's anything in here we can actually pick up. Um, I, excuse me. I spawned that in uh, from the creative menu, so I can't really pick that up. The radio just stays with the POI. I never actually did anything down here. I was going to, but I, I never I never actually did it, other than, of course, put the land claim block down. Um, this is not necessary anymore. Let's at least get this out of here. And we should probably fix that because we... You know, we, we definitely want to leave the place in good repair because the idea is that other troops will eventually come and occupy this place. Um, I'm looking for this. You know, you're kind of squirrely, ZTF. Why don't you just come over here? Oh, shit. Did she get an actual scream out? Yep, she did. All right, let's see if ZTF is worth his worth his salt here. Stay away from my chopper. Oh, he was he's like <laughs> he's like with the butt of his rifle. Good job, ZTF. You know, you're not half bad, dude. <laughs> All right. So, you know what? I just remember something, though. I can actually put stuff in his inventory. Um, yeah, he's he's actually got a decent inventory. Okay, so let's just have him. Let's, uh, yeah, let's load him up with, with ammo. We'll load him up with ammo. We've got so much stuff to, to take over there. And even with the, you know, with the helicopter, it's going to take us multiple trips. And let's also, let's actually grab our vehicles too. Well, the vehicle and the bicycle. I don't think there's anything in here, is there? Nope. Uh, yeah, like I was saying, it's going to take us multiple trips to do this, of course. And I'm not going to do all of this on camera either. I'm just... Kind of getting started with you guys and then i'll cut the camera and work on it off camera but here let's just grab as much of that as we can carry and your job ztf is to to man the ammunition show me your inventory so let's put one of those in there 
One of those, some of that, some of this, and then, oh, we don't have a, we don't have a way to, to move everything from here to here. There's, we can take from him to us, but not from us to him. So I guess we're going to have to do this the old fashioned way. Uh, we don't need to take that with us because that's very easily gotten on the other side. All right, so that fills ZTF up. Okay. Now, let's go to here. Uh, even, we might want to use that stuff for deco, so we'll take it. And we're going to take all of the brass, all of the lead, the cobblestone, the ingots, and as much iron as we can carry. I'm not going to fill, uh, put anything else in these other than these arrows. And we'll put these in here too. So that leaves us, what, seven, eight slots left? Uh, I may come back and get this stuff too. I mean, it's actually very useful because we, make, we can make concrete and stuff out of it. But um, it's also very easy to obtain. So what do we have in here? Nothing. Okay. So let's grab this as well. And I still have, you know, all of my inventory. You're completely full, right, buddy? Yeah, he's completely full. Okay. Okay, so we can do six more things in there and then whatever I can put in my inventory. So let's go up here. I'm going to put a door here. Turn you off. Uh, no, we'll actually leave that stuff there because I have extras here, which we'll grab. These are all the mods. I'll grab all of those. This is all stuff to sell. Um, so what we'll do is we'll run over to Rex and just sell this really quick. I'm not too worried about, <coughs> you know, getting maximum price or anything like that. I just want to get rid of it. Grab those sugar butts too. Uh, we don't want to sell the mods, so those we'll put. Okay, so that's all we can put in the chopper. Where's my repair kit? Did I put those in here? Yeah, right here. Okay, so let's grab those. We'll repair you. We'll repair you. And do I have an extra helmet light in here? Uh, yeah, right there. That on there just to increase its value a little bit. Okay, so yeah, let's run over to Wrecked and sell this stuff really quick. <laughs> what were you doing? Riding on the back, dude? <laughs> it's funny. It's like he just jumped right off the back of the motorcycle. And I think that's all we want to sell to him. Okay, let's just fill up the rest of our inventory. And then we will take off and do our first trip to our new forward operating base. So um, I got a lot of stuff in here that we're gonna, we are going to have to take. So it kind of doesn't really matter what we take first. You know, there's a few things in here we really could probably just go sell to Rec Depot as well. But I'll tell you what, I'll worry about that when we get back. Um, so let's just start grabbing all these parts here. Well, that I would sell to him. This I would sell to him just because we have one of them. Don't. We're not really ever going to do spears. <clears throat> Probably won't be doing sledgehammers. But I want to keep this stuff. We could sell them the machete parts, too. Definitely want the bike chassis. The 
auger. These are kind of supposed to be backup tools. We'll take that and that. Okay, so that completely fills us up. Let's drink one of these. But we've got all this food to grab. We've got all those meds, all those meds, all these clothing items. We emptied all of these, right? Yeah. Um, most all, all of that and most all of that. So we could probably... Oh, and all of this too, yeah. We could probably do this maybe in a second trip with ZTF's help. I'm thinking. We'll see. All right, buddy. I'm going to climb in the back here and... You jump in the pilot seat and take us over to where we need to go. And we're off. Um, let's let's mark our new location, which is here. Oh, yeah, it's already on the it's already on the compass, and it's also marked with the red flag. Okay, I'll see you guys over there. must have hit like a ceiling or something here because I can't seem to ascend any higher than this getting stuck in these damn trees so we should avoid these uh, this mountain on uh, subsequent trips That's going to be the new CC uh, right down there off to our uh, right side there. The original um, army barracks. But it, it's it's really, you know, between all the army camps and ranger stations, it's the best, you know, most well put together place for that. Um, it's all just role play anyways. We're not going to live there ourselves. But um, the plan is to set that place up as the command center for... Alpha 6, which we will do after we get our own place uh, situated. Okay, so let's go ahead and I don't think we have enough room to land in the yard. I mean, we probably could. But you wouldn't do that in real life because the rotors would, would would not clear everything. So we'll just land out front here. We might have to make ourselves a an actual uh, heli you know helio pad eventually because I I wouldn't mind getting this vehicle or aircraft I should say uh, for ourselves when we can get it legit you know. Get over here. Fine tune movements here. All right, that's good enough. Okay, so let's see here. I have I have not done anything with this place since we cleared it, a, you know, a couple episodes ago. Um, this is going to be our workshop, and I'm going to have to figure out what to do. With this, what is it? 30,000 hit point garage door. I didn't, if I remember, I, I didn't find a, a switch in here to open it, you know? So, we had some stuff that we left over, over in there. I'm just looking one last time before I spend 5,000 years breaking that damn thing. But yeah, I don't see a switch in here anywhere. So, all right. Where is my pick? 
Let's break it down. Yeah. I want to keep the iron from this, so we'll put a few things in here. I have not respect uh, since the Horde Knight. And that means we have... We have no 69er. That's why I keep running out of stamina trying to break this. Did we grab the auger? Um, I don't see it in here. Maybe we didn't grab it. Oh, no, it's in my own inventory. Duh. <laughs> Thanks, ETF. You're kind of handy to have around there, buddy. So, that takes care of that. Now... Um, do you have my, uh, whatchamacallit, impact driver? He doesn't. I might leave that bench there. Anything that doesn't look trashy and is not going to be in the way, we'll leave in place. Except for that. That's just going to take up too much space. Um, I'm probably going to remove all that stuff too, just because of the fact that we, uh, I'm going to want to put workbenches and stuff over here. Those hubcaps on the wall, we'll probably leave there. Let's get rid of that. We'll probably put storage all up along through here and maybe up here. Um, let's get rid of that. That's clay. somebody over here breaking stuff. Yeah, we've <laughs> we've got a lot of work to do. But I want to get the shop set up first cuz then we can get the workbenches set up, the storage for all of most of our crafting stuff. We'll I'm probably going to live in the house here. Um and so we'll we'll actually repair this kitchen and use this kitchen. So all the food types of things we'll we'll bring in here. Whoop! Excuse me. But most of the crafting stuff we'll we'll keep here in the shop. Okay. So. Oh, we just lost those. That's all right. This all looks kind of cool here. I'll probably leave it there if. If we can, you know, work around it without it being a big pain in the butt. I think that desk... Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Get all this stuff out of here. That's got to go. And, of course, the truck's going to have to go, too. I like this little chain uh, block and tackle thingamadoodle, so maybe we'll leave that there. We're gonna, we'll have to repair the roof, of course. Okay, so let's get the truck out of here. I'm not going to have room for all this stuff, am I? Yeah, maybe. We'll see. I'll repair it. Get that wall repaired. Okay, so... Definitely looking cleaner in here. I guess that's just painted on. Let's get this. I think I'm going to get rid of these. I might, I might leave the tires there just for aesthetic purposes. We'll see. Okay. All right. So, um, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to, uh, let's put our workstations down first. Then I'm going to make actual storage bins. And I think what we'll do is we'll line the storage bins all along this shelf up here, because why not? That would be a good place for them. Uh, all right. So let's grab our workbench first. Did I put, I put, I think I put those in the chopper. I think what we'll do is we'll put the forges along this wall 
Maybe we'll put one here and one here, caddy corner. So let's put the workbench right where Zulu Tango is standing. So that would be the second forge. So that means the workbench would go here, which it can't because of the bulletin board. So if we want to leave that bulletin board there for aesthetic purposes, why don't we put the workbench right there? Because why not? Okay. And then we can put the chemistry bench here. That works for me. Um, can we put two of these down here? Yes, we can. Okay, so we'll put a we'll make a second cement mixer and put that there. Yeah, I think it'll look good in here. In order to make the writable storage bins, we need nails. Did I grab nails? I probably did not. Uh, okay, so that means that means we're gonna need to make a forge, smelt some iron to make the nails to make the storage bins. I should have grabbed some nails. I didn't think about that. Okay, we can do that. So what do we need to make a forge? Probably stuff that we don't have with us. Um, we can make the log. Uh, we have cobblestone. Did I bring any leather? I did not bring any leather. Son of a... Well, that burn it. I didn't think this through very well, did I? Okay, plan B. We're just going to make a bunch of basic storage chests. Uh, no, not 195. <laughs> Jeez. Let's make, I don't know, six. I'm just going to temporarily line them up here so we can drop this load off and then go back and get another load. And then I'll move stuff from the storage chest to the permanent chest and then just take the, the old ones out. We don't need to bring all of this stuff with us. Let's just keep one SMG. <clears throat> we'll keep our knife with us so we have something. And I'm going to put everything else in here, except for we want to keep a stack of ammo with us. Let's keep some beverage. Some bandages. Some wood. And yeah, I think we can leave the rest of this stuff here. Okay. Give me all your stuff. And we'll put all of his stuff in here. Except for, once again, our... Uh, here, let's put this stuff down here. I don't, I don't even care what's going where, because this is all very temporary. Okay. So that drops everything off. All right, guys, well... Um, let's see how we're doing on our time. I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the episode here. Um, because you get the basic idea. I mean, I'm going to, I'm going to have to make at least one more trip. I might have to make even two more, but we might be able to get the rest of it with one more trip with the ZTF's help here. And then I'm going to come in here. I'm going to build the, the writable storage chest. I'm going to get everything organized in here and start just you know repairing the place and cleaning the place up and figuring out how i'm going to organize stuff we are finished with this episode so thanks everybody for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment and share the video and we'll catch you all in the next episode Bye bye